This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Everywhere I go, I'm gonna let it shine. Everywhere I go, I'm gonna let it shine. Everywhere I go, I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. All through the night, I'm gonna let it shine. All through the night, I'm gonna let it shine. All through the night, I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Hello boys and girls and welcome to another episode of the Methodist Children's Prime Time. I trust that you have been doing very well. I am Auntie Alicia. God has been so good to us that we can stand and sing today and are we yet alive. I trust that you had a blessed Christmas and that this new year has been a good one thus far. Let us pray. Loving God, we come before your presence at this time, bringing glory and honor unto your name. We come to you, O God, as King and Lord over our lives. We come, O God, recognizing that there is none like you. Lord God, you are Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, the first and the last. And we worship and we adore your name this day. And even as we begin, O oh God, this new year, we pray your blessing upon us, especially upon our children, O oh God. We pray, O oh God, that you will be their guide. We pray, O oh God, that your spirit of comfort will forever be with them. We pray for your protection, O oh God, over their lives that they go through day by day. Even as they return to schooling, O oh God, in a new way, we pray your protection. We pray, O oh God, that you enable them to learn in this new way, in this new manner. That whether they are in the physical classroom or online, O oh God, we pray, O oh God, that you will help them to remember, help them to learn, help them to grasp, O oh God, the work. We pray, O oh God, that they will not be far from you, far from your word. That even in this time, O oh God, that their faith and their love for you will increase. And then they will come to a deeper and newer relationship in you during this year. Lord God, we pray for your comfort over their lives. We pray for your love, O oh God. We pray for your peace and joy and happiness for them. We pray, O oh God, that you surround them with blessings, O oh God, overflowing, that they will know for sure that you are indeed their father. You are indeed their friend and brother. So loving God, we give you thanks for the year that is past. And we praise you, O oh God, for what we know you will do in this new year. Continue to be our guide. Bless our children, we pray. In Jesus' name, Amen. Hello, boys and girls. I'm Auntie Valerie, and I greet you in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, who is our brother and friend. Last year, you were encouraged to learn the books of the Bible. Jude and Re Revelation conclude the New Testament which has 27 books. The book of Jude has one chapter 
and it contains a familiar blessing and a call to persevere, you know, to press on, to endure. Jude, who was the brother of James the Just, wrote reminding us what Jesus and others said about living in the last days. They said that there will be people who don't take the things of God seriously anymore. They'll treat them like a joke and follow their own way. They will think only of themselves and will cause division. They will not behave Christ-like. But my dear boys and girls, you and I are encouraged to be diligent in prayer and doing what is right with the Holy Spirit's help. You and I are called to be kind and loving and to tell about the love of God for all people so that your friends and family and your neighbors will believe in Jesus Christ and know and experience God's love for themselves and live for him. So many people hopeless, so many live in fear, they wander in the darkness, they cry a lonely tear. So many people hurting, and it seems nobody cares, but you can be the difference with all the love you share. Auntie Alessa, I would like to wish the children all over the world a happy new year 
And may this year be a blessing to each and every one of you as you continue to serve God. Serve Him in love and in truth. Keep focus on God and He will see you too. Love you children and all the best for the new year. Thank you. I greet you in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. I take this opportunity to wish our boys and girls around the world a blessed and safe New Year 2021. May this new year bring many opportunities your way to explore every joy of life. May our Lord and Savior bless you as you have new aspirations, new resolutions. I trust my warm wishes will meet you in great spirit. Have a promising and fulfilling New Year. 2021. Good afternoon everyone. My name is Jeremiah Barker and I am from Guyana. Today I would just like to pray for all the children in the world who are suffering. Please bow your head and close your eyes, clasp your hands and pray with me. Oh Heavenly Father, we hope that you will help those children in need. Help those who are lacking in food at this time. Help those who do not have a shelter at this time. Help those who cannot whose parents cannot afford education for them. Help them, O oh Father. For they are the future of the earth, and they will grow to do many wondrous things, which is why I ask you to spare them, O oh Lord. And let them live let them have food shelter water and a good education so that they can grow to do many things and benefit the world in Jesus name and pray amen thank you for doing this prayer with me and I hope that you all have a happy and prosperous new year well boys and girls do remember that no matter what happens, God cares for you. I want to leave this thought for you to reflect on. God's way is always the best way. Today, we close our program with a blessing from Jude. And now to him who can keep you on your feet, standing tall in his bright presence, fresh and celebrating to our one God, our only Savior, through Jesus Christ, our Master, be glory, majesty, strength, and rule before all time, and now, and to the end of all time. Yes.
And love and people bring to happiness I've found Using things and love and people Not the other way around Cause love and things and using people For you and me For you and me